Let's go into a dream world, okay? Are you into spirits and stuff like that? Are you into zodiac I'm spirit, signs? Yeah. You I'm are spiritual. Cool. Perfect. <laughs> Let's say, okay, you meet the man of your dreams. Six for three, nice teeth, money. Finally, a guy taller than you. He accepts you for your past. <laughs> and he's ready to, and you guys have been together for a while, right? But you, right, being the spiritual woman that you are into zodiac signs and everything else, you're like, you know what, man? Before I take this plunge, my fr my girlfriend, she got me a free fortune teller read. Let me go ahead and go check out this lady, right? And I want all you ladies as well to, to be involved in this, right? So you go ahead and you go to this fortune teller. And the fortune teller tells you, I know he's the man of your dreams, but in 10 years, you're going to live a great eight, nine years with him. But in year eight, he's going to have an alcohol problem, go broke, and lose his physique and no longer be the man that you fell in love with. Now, I'm going to ask you, would you stay with that man knowing that that is going to happen? I'll start here and then work my, work my way. Would you stay with that man knowing 10 years from now, he's going to become broke, fat, and he's not going to be the man that you uh, fell in love with? You know, let's go sooner in two years. Mm. Oh, that's quick. Mm -hmm. In two years. Mm -hmm. Would you? You wouldn't? Mm -mm. Okay, you wouldn't? Okay. What about you? No, I've had a fortune teller tell me things that would happen, and they did, and I was like, okay. Like, okay, wow. Okay, wow. so you've actually happened in real life. Fantastic, yeah. even better. Yeah, I wouldn't. You wouldn't? No. Okay, what about you? I, I wouldn't. Okay, what about you? <clears throat> okay, what if? We're talking about what ifs, right? No, no, you know for a fact this is going to happen. For a fact. I know, but like, what if like I made sure, okay, so he became broke and all that, like, what if I did things to where like... Butterfly effect? Yeah, 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 like you're trying to like stop it, and yeah. then like, or if it did happen, like it's what, inevitable. Is he going to become like okay? But that were to happen to him, because maybe it's he out of your control. Up. It's out of your control. He's going to lose the drive. He's going to become an alcoholic, and it's happening. Whether you make the money, become successful, whatever, it's happening. He ain't changing. I think the one thing that would push me is the alcoholism. So yeah, I would definitely. Okay. You would not. You want to do it? Mm -mm. You want to stay? What about you? Definitely not. You want to stay? Mm -mm. I think two years. Definitely not, but okay. maybe, maybe ten. And real quick, out of curiosity, yeah, that's why what I was going to say. Why eight, not? I probably would have two years. Yeah, why, why not? Why not stay with him? I feel like you don't really know someone until like you're with them for more than two years, maybe three years, four years. Every so, I feel like I don't know, ten years. Well, I, I, I mean, you, but he's but the man of your dreams. Two years from now, y'all have been together for four or five. I don't know. I feel like two years, I wouldn't, and ten, I would. Okay. What about you? It's a waste of time. Okay. Okay. Are we still in love here, or he's just fat <laughs> now and he's a drunk? I mean, I mean, I, let, let's everyone. Be, I feel like as you get older, everyone loses like their look. They're not going to look like you look now forever. Of course, so. but you got to remember that women love differently than men. What about you? My answer is not changing. It's not changing. Mm -mm. Now it's ten years. Why? No, no, no. It's two years. But I'm saying why? Why? Why did you say no? Oh, that you okay. That you want to stick with him? Why no? Well, it's because of the alcohol. To be honest. Okay. What about yeah. you? It's so many other options. You can't even put <laughs> their finger on it. Okay, so I, I love that y'all said that, right? You triggered my trap card. Yo, so yo, <laughs> oh, just like y'all, right? The reason, and I'll just deal with the elephant in the room here. The reason why you guys said no is because future. women are very interested in the future. Yep. Okay. Oh, shit. Women are interested in a man's future, which is cool. It is what it is. If I'm gonna commit to this man and he's gonna, I'm gonna provide. He's gonna provide me security, and I'm depending on him. He better. I better make damn sure the future is bright. Well, guess what? Just like y'all care about the future, we care about the fucking past. Mm. So what I'm saying is that if you do certain oh, things, okay, I get it. Yeah, 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 there you go, oh, man. Is that why, like, uh, 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 going back, going back to <laughs> your thing? Yeah, right. You're saying, well, it's yeah. my past, blah blah blah. Okay. It goes back to the credit score thing, and to the same reason, you broke it off with a guy off a of fortune teller in real life. <laughs> no, I didn't break up with him. I met him later, and then like he was, it was just, it was a mess. I can't really say. Like, the <laughs> point of the matter is, women are interested in futures, men are interested in pasts. Just saying. Okay, so if you do certain things, <laughs> certain guys will disqualify you based off your past, unfortunately. But what about okay. they don't know? They don't find out about your past. I'll just say it, ladies. Here's the brutal truth: if you're a stripper, <laughs> porn star, only fans, only fans, you do any type of work where you market your sexuality for monetary compensation. You don't have leverage with a certain class of man. Mm -hmm. You must accept the reality that you are going to have to accommodate him mm -hmm. because of your past. Okay. If I have a crappy credit score, 
I must accept the Ain't 10%. Ain't nobody told me that before I started stripping. Hey, man. <laughs> now you know. Now you know. <laughs> what? But, but I, know. Can't, I can't get mad at the bank for giving me a 15% interest rate because my credit sucks. Mm -hmm. That's what I have to deal with because I made bad decisions in the past. Now, I get it. That sucks. You made that decision. You might have not known that there's consequences or whatever. But that's the world that we live in.